Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Sims 4. Alrighty, when we left off, we had uh, just gotten into a new job, and we are doing pretty well at it, I think. And uh, now we're just going to head back home and uh, get some of our rest in that we desperately need. <laughs> now, with that said, there's also the small thing of me reloading the game because I, you know, stopped it, went to do stuff, came back, and uh, this will take a bit <laughs> uh, because of the settings of the amount of sims I have. I actually looked into it. The maximum is actually 240 sims. Uh, I'm happy I didn't set it for that. I have it for 150. That's about the mid-range. Uh, the minimum was about 80, but I figured that would start getting, you know, a little old, a little fast. So I figured 150 is pretty good, decent range to still run into new people every now and then. And uh, that's what we're doing. We are at home, relaxing, gaming a little bit just to get our fun up, and now it's time for bed. Oh, yeah, I know. You, you need to go to bed. You need to be at work tomorrow. Just so you can do more detective working. And sleep. <laughs> A text from Vladislaus Strahd. Just wanted to welcome you to the community, and my, that's a lovely neck you have there. Uh, that's creepy, but no. Bye. I completely forgot the vampires were a thing. Ah, uh, jeez. I'm going to have to invest in some garlic. A bit of garlic. Oh, boy. Work starts in one hour, and I haven't ate yet. Joy. Uh, go grab the uh, leftovers. You don't even really have to focus on making your bed, but okay. I'm happy that it doesn't take, for making the bed, it doesn't take the 10 minutes that it used to in the older games. You just have to, you have to set everything just right and make it flat, and it's like, who fucking cares? Just throw the sheet back on it. You're good. Duty calls. The world is a never-ending cesspool of grime and crime, and it's time for Thomas to take a big bite out of it. Sounds gross. Yeah, you, you made it sound even worse than it probably was going to care to join them or should they go to work alone uh, I'll join them I'll join Tom this time I'll join me this time in their job which is not my real job this gets confusing fast <laughs> all right dryer lint traps are infamous for starting fires yeah I know that's why I clean mine like a normal person Oh, this coffee's still way too hot. I've taken a, a new approach to making my coffee, which was kind of because I had a cold, which was adding honey to it to try and soothe the throat, the soothe, soothe the throat a little bit. And uh, I discovered I really like the extra, you know, added taste of the clover honey to my coffee. So, uh, I do it regularly now. I don't add, like, a fuck ton, but I add enough. I add enough. All right. Training day two. Train harder. <laughs> There's still a bit more to learn before you'll be ready for your own case. First, it's time to get out into the community and start building your reputation as a friendly protector and or hardened authority figure. Okay. After that, you get to take a shot at finding and arresting a suspect. Get a move on, rookie. Okay. Uh, go on patrol. Uh, go on patrol. I've discovered that the suspect is a teen. So it was a teenager pulling some shit. All right. Sounds about right. 
teenagers are usually the uh, destructive type, and it looked like they caused a lot of uh, damage to the house, from what I remember. It may look like the game is freezing. That's why I'm talking, to make you guys realize, no, it's not freezing, it's, it's still working. It's not your video. Just, sometimes the, lo the loading takes a bit of, a bit of time. So don't worry. But every once in a while I might, you know, speed it up. Suspect is a teen, and I'm out on patrol. Okay. When an officer is on patrol, they can get to know the community and help keep troublemakers in check. Talk with residents to make a friendly or mean impression. If you see anyone littering or fighting, issue a citation to make sure they obey the law. Well, I have to issue a citation? Come on! Fuck quotas, man. Quotas are fucked up. Also, where the fuck am I? Am I in the park? Am I in a park? Looks like I'm in a park. Huh. The suspect is an art lover. What does that have to do with anything? What? The suspect is wearing jeans. Is an art lover. Is female. Oh, okay. All right. Teenager, female, art lover, and wearing jeans. Fair enough. Now it's just find something to do in the park. Uh, there's not there's not a lot of people in the park right now. So I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. Um I guess I'll just let my guy roam free while I look for people to come in. What time is it? Like 8 a.m. Yeah, of course there's no one here. What the fuck am I... What the fuck am I doing here at 8 a.m.? Of all times. There's almost no one here. But that's what the criminals want you to think. For all you know, they could be hiding in places. Ooh, I see someone. An avant-garde person. I'm assuming that's a club they're in. Gunther Munch. A hell of a name. Hi there. Oh, you're angry. Oh, you are angry. You are a madman. Not that you're crazy. You're just mad. <laughs> I should have probably uh, led with angry. Okay. I'll see if I can get over to him quicker. Hi there, Gunther Munch. How's it going? Hello there, civilian. How's it going? Oh, shit. It's more people. More people now. Um, Marissa Ritchie. Okay. Then... Whoever that was. I didn't catch the name. Supriya Delgado. Okay. And... Victor Feng and Brent Hecking. <laughs> Brent Hecking, really? That's a hell of a name. <laughs> what a hecking name that guy has. Tell you what. It's just a random pooch. Uh oh. I'm getting tense. There's people. Alright, uh, is this. Dig. What? I'm gonna dig. I'm gonna dig in the middle of a field. Make me look crazy. Crazier. I usually am. And. <laughs> He's still angry. He's still very angry. Uh. Okay. Try to calm. I was gonna say try to calm down, but I guess that's not gonna work. Yes, I can flaunt my wealth that I don't have. Sure. Uh, shout forbidden words. Uh, flu. There you go. Make you feel so much better now. 
I'm still hungry. Son of a bitch. Okay, well. What is that? What is... That looked like a treasure chest from far away. Look for frogs. No. No, I don't want to. Don't want to do that. What the fuck is this? Thomas can't travel because he's working. Well, duh. Makes more sense. Um, who are you? You're Salem Benali. Or Salim Benali? I don't know. Um, issue citation for what? What did he do? I didn't even see what he did. I'm just going to issue a citation because I can? What? Oh, he tried to fight him, I guess? Okay. That, that explains a bit, I guess. Okay. Um, I just still had my leftovers in my pocket. <laughs> I forgot you can hold on to your leftovers. Uh, in your actual pocket. That's fucking great. Okay. Uh, I'm, I'm just... Don't mind me. Don't mind me, citizens. I'm just having a snack. Oh, who are you? Ker Katarina Lynx. Katarina Lynx, huh? What, you, what are you doing? Wild Madnip. What? Oh, I can't even read it anymore. You took all of it. Damn it, lady. All right. I wanted to know what it was. I heard, read something about cats and then disappeared. All right. Um, what is this? Socially awkward. Sims who are loners have a tough time being social. Any awkward situation isn't enough to embarrass them. Yeah, sounds like me. Sounds like me. Because it is me. There's Katarina Lynx. There they are. Or young adult, I think it said. Yes. Okay. Um. Chat was Sup Supriya. 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 I want to say Supriya. Supriya. Hi there. Who are you? You're redhead, so already interested. Katrina Caliente. Hmm. I shouldn't do that while I'm on the clock. Shouldn't do that while I'm on the clock. No, no. I guess they're asking for me for something. Some reason. Uh... Uh, what? Why am I embarrassed now? <laughs> that just happened in the background. Why am I just embarrassed? Is it just because the uh, tense moodlet got taken away? I guess. That makes sense. All right. I'm contacting you on behalf of Be Fit as a Fiddle Co., We'd like to send you a free sample of our newest product, Hits Earbuds. If you'd like to buy more, we accept online orders through the computer. We also make a treadmill, rock climbing wall, and other fitness videos via your TV. Be well. Okay. I have earbuds now. Hmm. I... Okay. Hey. All right. All right. You know what? All right, I got to issue a citation. That was fucked up. You didn't even seem like you were doing anything, so I'll let you be. Especially because, you know, this guy already came in angry. I already knew he was angry. It's all on him. Okay. So, I should return to the police station now. Actually, now that I think about it. Um... Da, 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 trying to make sure I hit the right buttons. There we go. <sighs> well.
Alrighty. You have processed enough clues to issue an all-points bulletin in APB. While you have a rough description of the suspect, the more clues you find and process, the more specific the description becomes. When you have a very detailed description of the perp, you will be less likely to arrest an innocent who shares a few similarities with the guilty party. That would be nice to avoid. Uh, just going to get rid of this. There we go. Keep the clues that we have. Also, yeah, I'm going to let him go to the bathroom because, boy, does he need to go. All right. Do I have any more clues I need to process? Huh. Um, turn on? Um, what choices do I have here? Uh, spooky. <laughs> Why not? Alright, um, issue null points bulletin. Guess I'll go do that. Uh, how do I... How? How do I do the thing? Um... Guess I was just going to go chat on the computer there for a second. How do I do an all points bulletin? How do I do that? Oh, there it is. I do it there, on the cork board. Okay, an APB will take you to the location of a sighting of someone matching your suspect's description. All right. That's probably a good idea to do. I'm wondering why it's taking my sim so long to uh, get to doing it. Even though I just said to do it. Okay. Oh, so he can he can hear music around him and him alone. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, so I have to make sure to remember all the clues. Art lover. Female. Teen. Wearing jeans. Female, art, lover, teen, wearing jeans. Just have to make sure I remember all of that. Change in music tone. All points bulletin. I can't, I can really talk. Really, I can't. A sus... Bleh. Then promptly prove, no, I can't. A suspect fitting the APB description has been spotted in this area. Ask around to see if anyone can point you towards the suspect. Use a notebook to review the suspect description before you make an arrest. If you arrest the wrong person, it won't look good on your record. All right. Well, I'm currently still embarrassed. This is annoying. Um, okay. Baby Ariel. Wearing jeans, teenager, you're a young adult, Kayla Fleming, rising star. Oh, of course, proper celebrity. Of course it's a rich person. They think they can get away with anything, or rather a celebrity. They don't necessarily have to be rich to be a celebrity. You know, you, just, you don't have to be rich to be a celebrity, just saying. Okay, uh, anyway, I'm going to talk to you. Turn off fan, sh fame, sh fam shine, fame shine. How about no? Uh, a citizen might be able to provide information about the whereabouts of your suspect. Um, friendly? Ask to take picture? No. Uh, to be fair, she's wearing jeans. It's a teenager. Um, art lover. 
I'll ask her first, and if she runs, then it's probably her. <laughs> that attitude, though. I'm by Yampe. Uh. Yes. Uh Farine. Wakaroo. Shemaya. Mm hmm. Varanoi. Gwas. You think it's that way? So saw someone like that a while ago over there. Okay. Um. I'm not seeing a lot of places I can go to find that. I can't visit the gym. I can't visit the bar, which is right over there. Um, I have a feeling you're lying to me. I have a feeling you're lying to me. Dancing. Okay. Uh, where am I going? Um, where am I going? Okay. Um, where am I? Uh, I'm in a... I'm in some place. Where am I currently? This is... Fuck if I know, man. This is the museum. This is the gym. Okay. I have no idea where I am currently. This is a place that I'm supposed to be to find the suspect. And... Quite frankly, I still have a feeling that this is the suspect right behind me. Um, ask about suspect. I guess I'm just watching her dance. All right. All right, let's stop. Stop. Stop watching and just ask. Ask about suspect. Come on. Okay. Miss Rising Star over here dancing the night away. Trying to fucking talk to... Ri Ryako? Nakamura? Okay, come on. Come on. Okay. Uh-huh. Um. Can I ask you? Hinara Yoboro Shoba. Uh-huh. With they're both pointing directly at baby Ari. I don't see anyone else matching this description. I'm pretty sure she was lying. There we go. On the road to fame because I arrested a celebrity. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it makes a lot of sense that she points. Oh yeah, I, I saw them over there when there's no one over there. And I can't access any of the buildings over there. But then when I talk to the other two, you know what? She matches that description. <laughs> And they're both like, oh yeah, she she absolutely does. That's that's probably her. <laughs> Alrighty. Why did I even bother asking her first? <laughs> that's that's what I want to know. Why did I bother? Alrighty. Now that you've learned about work. Okay, that was a weird phrasing. Now that you've learned about work out in the world, you, you should... Uh, 
My brain is broken, apparently. You should know that there's plenty to do around the station, too. Run criminals through the booking station, take crime reports from civilians, and get to know your co-workers. You can also use the gym upstairs to stay fit or browse the database on a computer to bolster your knowledge of the criminal mind. Hmm. Fair enough. Guess I can do any one of these things before work lets out. Uh, I'm going to stay late today. Also, Sims now have the ability to become celebrities. There are many different ways to become a celebrity. And as your Sims progress... Hmm. Sorry, I misread that. Sims progress in their skills and careers. More paths to stardom will become available. Some great ways to become famous include pursuing a career in acting, raising the media production skill via the video station or music station objects. Look for interactions labeled with plus fame. Each of these will contribute towards becoming a superstar. Alrighty, towards. I can pronounce things. Really, I can. Alright, and since... I've already discovered that particular person. No need to keep holding on to those clues. What so is this? Yumiko Yamaguchi. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, that was a noise out of my stomach. I apologize. Rain Kemp. Uh, Erica Mori. And Mosh, Mosh Sherwood. I'm surprised that the person I just arrested isn't here. That's weird. Hey, you're the guy who I issued, like, two citations to. Guy? You here to try and contest them? Good luck. Gonna need it. Alright, um... Browse the police database, take mug shots at the booking station, or exercise for one hour. Well, I mean, there is a bunch of exercise stuff up here. Uh, practice punching. Would that count as uh, exercise? We'll find out in a bit, I guess. Alrighty. What the hell is that moodlet? Celebrity sighting. Oh, okay. That's what that's for. Because I saw a celebrity. Acquired the fitness skill. I'm only now acquiring the fitness skill. Okay. Allow him to perform various workouts on the workout equipment. As the skill level increases, more advanced exercise routines will become available. Well, that's good to know. Alright. Let's get rid of that. Just fucking... Eh. <laughs> the fucking bag. <laughs> wow. That is bad. Just look at me. Eh. Eh. <laughs> I just stand there for a bit. Eh. <laughs> okay. Search criminals in the booking station. Alright. Fair enough. I can do that. Maybe. Uh, yeah, I can search the suspect. Um, who should I search? Uh, Moss Sherwood. Why not? The only guy in the jail currently. It's not weird. If I do it. <laughs> it is shocking how many women are in this jail. It's mildly shocking. Notable newcomer, civilian Vanessa Jung. That's that's a hell of a hair color. All right, there we go. Let's go search. I'll take a mug shot, and uh, then later I guess fingerprint after I do one of those. All right. Heading down. Hey, you. I need to search you. All right. Now we head over to the booking station. Oh, my day is almost done from the look of it. I already extended my shift once. I don't think I can extend it any further. Easy. What am I finding on this guy? 
Jaisal Bashi. Bromp? Bashi. <laughs> How did he manage to get in with a hammer? All right, well. Ooh, bunker. <laughs> All right, cool. Done. I will uh, also take your mug shot. Where, where are you going, dude? Dude, dude. dude just, I will work. My work day will end in one hour. Okay, what the fuck am I doing? Okay, well, fuck that, I guess. Alright, um... Chat. Okay. Chat with her? Don't see why not. Where am I up? I guess I'm upstairs. Alright. Chat with... What's your name? Mizuki Shimizu. The lab tech. Okay, sure. Start with her. That's a hell of a head accessory you're wearing there. Actually, your hairstyle's kind of interesting, too. Kind of got a lot going on up the uh, old facial region there. Not bad. Not bad. Okay, well, pff. zoomed in at the wrong spot. Okay. Discuss case theories with co-workers. Um... You're the detective, aren't you? Okay, come on. Can I... I wanted to... Okay. Advic... I just want to make sure I'm reading that right. Advic Srivastava. Srivastava. Okay. I'm assuming that's how you pronounce it. All right. Chat with Izzy. Who the fuck is Izzy? I have no idea who Izzy is. Oh, hey! There may be a shinier badge and new title in the future. You've been promoted to officer. Make an additional eight per hour. One second. <coughs> Sudden sneeze. Sorry about that. <laughs> we will now make an additional eight dollars per hour. Or simoleons, rather. For a grand total of 28 per hour. Still more than I make in real life. I've also received the following bonus of $160 and new clothes. Uh, the next shift is Wednesday at 8 a.m. Good to know. Good to know. But I am being very well rewarded. And here we are back home, celebrating our promotion to officer by going probably to bed. <laughs> All right. Uh, first things first, though, we shall eat our food. Get some leftovers. Check on everything else. Yeah, it's just mainly hunger. Probably need to go to the bathroom after, though. So let's go do that. And then, I guess... Probably should work on writing a little bit. Yeah, let's do that. Really? You're just going to lay it on the counter? Come on. Really? Really, me? We're going to play this game? Just clean it up. Like a goddamn more normal person. Would you for once? All right. Huh. I had a good moodlet from a good workout. Didn't realize I did. Moving on up. Sky is the limit in this career. For now, anyway. Got a promotion. Don't get too cocky. All right. Well, I think I can end the episode here for right now. Because, uh, we got our promotion. Another day of work. Just took two days to get to a promotion. 
If only that worked in real life. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in comments so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat playing games and... You know, making good progress in life. Uh, got the promotion after two days of work. Uh, after we caught the criminal relatively quickly. Uh, despite the fact that we immediately ran into the criminal. Figured she couldn't be the criminal. That'd be too easy. And then found out, oh, wait, no, wait. That's exactly who it was. So uh, I looked a little stupid there. But we found her and we arrested her for you.